It is almost time to fall back and switch the clocks once again. Or is it? One 11 Alive viewer wanted to clear up a little confusion about the time change here in Georgia. So our Liza Lucas verifies. Daylight saving time ends November 7th, but 11 Alive viewer Brian Collins has a question first. With Governor Kemp signing the bill to stay on daylight saving time permanently, will we fall back this year? Brian, let's verify. Our sources are Georgia Senate Bill 100, the Uniform Time Act of 1966, and the National Conference of State Legislatures. To start, Georgia Governor Brian Kemp did sign Senate Bill 100 last spring. That legislation would make daylight saving time permanent year round in the state. But look closer. The bill states this becomes effective only by congressional amendment. In other words, it takes an act of Congress to become official. And Georgia's not the only state waiting. 19 states have enacted legislation or passed resolutions to provide for year-round daylight saving time. But while the Uniform Time Act allows states to opt out of daylight saving time by state law, like Arizona and Hawaii have done, federal law does not currently allow full-time daylight saving time. So like Senate Bill 100 says... Congress would have to amend the Uniform Time Act before states could officially adopt changes. So Brian, don't forget to set your clock. We can verify it's true that Georgia will have to fall back again this year and keep switching back and forth until Congress says otherwise.